Hi, my name's Roger. I'm a member of 909, and today I'm gonna to be talking to you guys about the behind the scenes at our studio. Hey, we're here at the 909 studio where we do film, broadcasting, and multiple varieties of media. Right here, as you can see, is our um, outside computer studio where we work on our projects and we do tons of um, media projects that relate to what we do on the show. All right, so here we are in the 909 control room where we do our morning announcements. Right here we have Sebastian and Ryan, two of our co-directors for um, the announcements. So guys, what is it exactly that you guys do? So my name is Ryan Bayano. I'm the co-director of 909 Live. My job is to basically ensure that the stream is running perfectly on YouTube. I count down all of the anchors when Sebastian is running all of the elements, and yeah, that's what I do. Uh, and I'm Sebastian Hernandez, I co-direct with Ryan. And yeah, like, like you said, I run the switcher, um, make sure all the elements are running out, making putting our show together, putting all the elements together so we, our fantastic viewers can have a, a great show. Great. All right, um, what is it exactly that you guys, um, or that's different compared to what we did with the last studio? Compared to the last studio, I'd say the biggest change is that we're working with completely new equipment. You know, before we used to just run the whole show on this program on the computer, but now we're working with this whole professional TriCaster system, which is used in like real live television by professional news stations. So I have to say that's the biggest change. Yeah, definitely. And also we got new cameras, which is awesome. And a new, like a new studio desk, which is great for our anchors putting the set together. Before we ran on a green screen, so now we have our own professional set and it looks awesome. So here we are in the main studio where we have our cameras that we use for um, teleprompter as well as recording our um, announcers. And on top of that, we also have our desk, which was generously donated to us by a patron that was actually um, in league with Fox Sports. So we were able to get their desk. And also, in addition to that, we have a camera right here that has a preview to all of our shows. And you can actually see me on one of those cameras right there. Pretty impressive. Our last thing that I want to mention that's a part of our um, new studio is the fact that we actually have a teleprompter. Right now, it's not on because we just finished our show. But how it works is we plant the script into this computer and then we hook it up to this where it reads off. And that's basically how our teleprompter works. It's not um, super advanced, but it helps us get the job done. Our final thing that I wanted to mention before we end is that I actually got a chance to interview one of our anchors about their time in the program and what their favorite parts about it were. So take a look. Um, hi, I'm Angela Mazza. I've been doing broadcasting for nine years. Um, I know that sounds crazy, but I, I started in fourth grade at our lower school production broadcasting program. Uh, it's called Stallion Today. And then we eventually brought that through middle school. Um, I been doing this, it feels like my whole life. My older sister actually did it, and my mom was the teacher. My mom had been the teacher for the high school, middle school, and lower school at the time. So she was teaching me and my older sister, and then she stopped doing the high school. Um, so she focused on just lower school and middle school. So I was lucky enough to learn from her because she was a great teacher. Um, and then we got Mr. Applebaum, and I've been fortunate enough to carry out the rest of my high school and eighth grade year with him. Um, what is it that you do on air? I do a little bit of everything, but predominantly I am on air. Um, I know how to edit. I've been doing it since middle school. Mr. Applebaum always instills in us how important it is to be able to do a little bit of everything. So occasionally I'll hop back there, do the mics. Pretty sure I can run a show as well. I've watched Sebi enough times to do it, but yeah, I do, I do a little bit of everything, but predominantly I'm most confident on air. So that's all we have at our studio right now, but we're in the process of making more stuff, getting better at what we do. So stay tuned for what's to come. Thanks.